Yo, what is happening, my people? I am back today with another video, and we are going to be continuing the Can You Make Profit series on this channel. Uh, I finally got my hands on more Shining Fits. Thank you to T-Rex for letting me know where to get that. And um, today we're going to be opening one of the collector tins, the Cramorant tin. Um, so without further ado, let's get on. Right, so for today, I've gone for here. I've, I've changed up the setting a bit so, so we can have a look at the Cramorant tin a bit better. And uh, we got a different angle to open the packs at. So let's get this off. I already unpackaged it. I have this beautiful Cramorant V promo card, which if I get out. Is, uh, here it is. Wait, let me just move the tin a sec. There it is. Beautiful Cramorant promo card. It's very nice. It's got a nice shine to it. I love shiny Cramorant. And obviously, we have the five packs. So let me just sleeve up the Cramorant. Yeah, the pack's ready. I actually have no sleeves on hand. Right, here we go. Right, we got the Cramorant sleeved and we can leave it there. It's actually a really cool angle. And uh, we can get our packs, put them there. We've got two Charizards at the back, so hopefully they can bring us some luck. Um, so yeah, first pack, I'm going to... If you lock the code card, there you go. So we go one, two, three, four. It feels like ages since I've opened packs. So we got a wonderful steel type energy, a floatzel. I have just knocked my camera by accident. A thwacky, a rotom, an Eevee, a Morpeko, a Tutul, a Nickit, a Grookey. A shiny Squirvert, a baby shiny Squirvert. Wow, I wasn't expecting that. And a Yan Mega. I need this Squirvert because obviously going for the the master set, the complete set of Shining Fit. So the Squirvert is very nice. Thank you, pack number one, for starting us off very nicely. Here we go with pack numero dos. Um, let me throw that away. There's the code card. Boom, one, two, three, four. To the front. I've accidentally ruined the card trick, but we got a rusted sword. Now we've got our energy. Now we've got a floatzel, a dartrix, yanma, morpeko, tutel, eevee, horsey. Will we get back to back shinies? Nope, we get a reverse boss's orders and we get a boss's orders. Great. Cool. Cool. Dragapult let me down in the first pack i've ruined this pack i can't get it open come on pack just open for me there we go boom code card one two three four i declare a thumb war electric energy hmm. floatzel hmm. rusted sword dartrix trap inch Buizel. coffin Shinx, it's the next one. No, it's not. Rookie, a shiny hatch room. I actually need this card as well. So I'm happy with that and a professor's research because I think in the last shiny fits opening, we got Hateno or Hatnio. I don't even know which one it is. So we'll add that to there. And now it leaves us with two Charizard packs. Will the Charizard packs have the wonderful Charizard in? There's the code card. One, two, three, four. Give me a Charizard. Psychic Energy. Tropius. One of T-Rex favorite Pokemon. Gym Trainer. Bloatzel. Rookie. Spinarak. Shinx. Horsey. Yanmama. Amazing Rare Kyogre. I've already got one. But we'll take another amazing rare Kyogre and a Dreadnought regular rare, which I have. Amazing rare Kyogre. That's that's three hits out of four packs. I will take that for sure. Um, we'll just put everything in the pile here. And now we have the last pack. The Shining Fate Charizard pack. 
Oh, I've accidentally knocked my camera whilst doing that. Come on, Charizard. Pull through with the Charizard. Boom. One, two, three, four. I declare a thumb war. Fighting energy. Floatzel. Rusted sword. Thwacky. Gossifleur. Rowlet. Kufan. Spinarak. Snom on a bench. A reverse ball guy. And a Frostmoth Hollow. Oh my god. I've actually needed this card for so long. I don't think you understand. I have needed this card for so long in my set. So I'm actually really happy with that. What's that? Four hits out of five packs. Let's do our recap in the order that, well, reverse order. Frostmoth, Kyogre, Shiny Hatrim, Shiny Squilbert, and obviously the Cramorant V promo card. And you know what? I'm gonna go total everything up and we'll see if we've made profit. Right, so I've totaled everything up. So if we come over to Excel, we can have a look. We can have a look at what we've got. Right, so we're on Excel now. I have totaled everything up as you can see right here. So the shiny squilver was going for around about five pounds. The hatch room was round about four fifty. The frost moth was round about one fifty. The Kyogre was round about eight pound. The Cramorant promo was round about four pound. And then bulk at five p a card for around about 45 cards is four pound. So in the total margin, you can see here, we have 28 pound total. And I got this for retail, which actually puts us in profit of two pound. So, you know, it's not much profit, but it's a little bit of profit. And it means that every single one of these videos that we've done, we've made profit. So, you know, it's not that bad. Obviously, you guys will probably get better. You guys can get better tins. You guys might get worse tins. Obviously, it's uh, always down to the look of what you pull. But yeah, that has been it from me. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And I hope to see you in the next one. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. I'm out. Peace.